Morning. 7.30 a.m. I don't know, my phone is charging the backpack. Great. Uh, time for breakfast. Breakfast. Ah, breakfast. The most important meal of the day. Not is it only, really? Well, not only is it very important in general, it's sometimes also the only decent meal we can get until dinner. Very so it's so. very important. It's a 10 minute walk from the hotel to the convention center called the Cohen Mess, where Gamescom is taking place. It's a bit chilly this morning. We're starting to wish we brought a jacket, but usually a few hours from now, it starts getting pretty warm. So we'll endure the cold. We finally got our press badges, and now we wait for the opening of Gamescom for the press. The exhibitors can already go in, obviously. It's scary to think that this is day one, and this is all press and exhibitors, but wait until you look outside. Press badge achieved. It's a tough market, we're in. Yeah. There's a lot of competition. At least, at least you, uh, at least I got mine, like, professionally cut. And, and green? And... <laughs> Dude, it's it's distinguish nice, myself. Nice nice print, I guess. <laughs> we seem to have hit a little of a hiccup. As you can see there are these turntables and they're automatic. You sort of scan your press pass, the barcode, and the turntable lets you in. Because Rurikans was green, it wasn't scanning, so I don't know what he's gonna do. I'm gonna walk in here by myself and I'll meet him at Bandai, where we have our first appointment. Gamescom has two areas, basically. Uh, the public area and the business area. The public area is all flashy, sort of like this. You can see THQ Nordic, big screens, big lighters, lots of lights. It looks awesome. There are many, many halls that I still haven't even shown you. But you get the picture. Big lights, big screens, pretty much what the public area is all about. We're now approaching a checkpoint into the business area. This is what my press badge is good for. The business area is a lot more sober. It's all lit up, it's not meant for the public. It's meant for presentations, behind closed doors, and every booth. It's kind of white, it has their own logo. My favorite is, of course, Cock Media. What happened to you? Remember how I was telling you that my barcode was longer than yours? But it was green. No, apparently it was also crooked. Ah, so the... So it's longer and crooked. Okay, so the reader and so couldn't display. the reader couldn't display it and I had to go in line again ah. and get another ticket. And I was still able to get here before you did. What were you doing? Oh, I was shooting B-roll for everything. Okay. Yeah. Fair uh, so this is the Bandai Namco booth. And as you can see on the inside, it's... Uh, Hey, they have tables for us to chill, to eat some stuff. They gave us these cards these, this year, which is new. So these are our appointments. Yeah. Basically, we're gonna That's see. A really, it's a really yeah. good way of doing it. We're gonna see Ace Combat at 9 10. That's our first thing. Once we go inside, we can't film. Yep. Usually. Uh, but we'll be able to capture stuff, see a presentation, and then bring you guys whatever we can bring you guys. Oh, you can play the new Naruto mobile in. on a TV that looks like a phone. Screen TV. Yeah. I'm in a little bit of trouble. Battery on my laptop has run out and I needed to capture stuff. Uh, it's lunchtime. It has run out while capturing Dragon Ball Fighters. I knew it was gonna run out, so I stopped recording and started again. So I know I have the footage I wanted. The PR for Bandai Namco has been great. She's gonna let me come back pretty much at any time. And I found a, far a charging station in the middle of Gamescom. Just left my laptop there, and now I'm sitting here, waiting for lunch. Hello? Everything Is went... Is this thing on? 
everything went great. <laughs> Laptop wasn't stolen. I charged it. We had a delicious lunch. Bandai Namco paid for it, so I guess I'm officially in Bandai Namco's pocket. So are you. Yep. Uh, yeah, we've definitely. been bribed. So the laptop wasn't stolen, but this is a robbery. Oh yeah, this armed robbery right here. This is two espressos. You can't, you can't actually tell. Okay, apart from, I, I have less battery than I thought I had on my laptop. 100% battery is like one hour and a half while capturing. I think it's actually less than an hour and a half. Maybe. <laughs> uh, Are you some okay? more games. Yeah. <laughs> I'm done for the day. You're gonna have an interview now. I'm going to check out Sinner, which is a new Souls-like game, and I'm also going to try and figure out where Frontier Developments is, because it's not in the map. Alright, I'm going to go back to the hotel, upload a bunch of stuff, and then hopefully come back and uh, meet up with Pally Time and Kai Berries. That's the plan, pretty much. I think Blizzard's going to steal them away. You're going to steal them away? Steal them back. It's yeah, fine. Back. Bye. <laughs> this is my hotel life. Uploads. It take ages. Finally got that uh, gameplay video up. I wanted to get it up as soon as possible. This is the speed I'm working with. This is the download, which is not that important. I mean, I need to download stuff, but it's not that often. Isn't that great? It's like, it's flatlined. It's dead. It's just, yep. <laughs> that sounds about right. <laughs> the upload took so long that Rurikan even made it here. He had a whole interview. And he tried to play Monster Hunter. Did I you get to play? play? Oh yeah, I played Monster Hunter. How is it? It's fucking fantastic. I doubt it. <laughs> and uh, yeah, that's how long the upload took. I've been at the yeah, hotel by myself. You got goodies? I got goodies. The hell is that? Is that know. put a sock in your face? It says multi-purpose in here, so I guess it's one of those things people... Uh, it's one of those sleeves that they say it's multi-purpose, but it's actually no purpose because it's useless. Why you gotta be like that? How many of those have you had over the course of your life? This one. That's the first one? Yeah. I'm surprised. But it says Moss 100 World, so it's fucking fantastic. Anyway, time for dinner. We're gonna have dinner at my favorite restaurant. Mm -hmm. In Cologne. In Cologne. <laughs> it's also the only one I've ever eaten. <laughs> first time I ate there. It's too spicy, yeah? Guy said, yeah. Guy said, this uh, this food is too spicy. Uh, Basically, you told I you said, yeah. Handle this. Just give me a little bit of spice. I couldn't Just handle. I couldn't handle the spice. It's too much spice. It's too spicy, yeah. So I've learned to not ask for the spice. I think we're calling it a day. Uh, we tried reaching out to Pally and Kaiberries. They replied, but they're not available. I think we're meeting with them tomorrow at the same time as we meet the guys at Gog. Which are, by the way, the coolest guys in the world. So we're gonna have a beer with them, uh, along with Kai and Pally time. Ruri's also done for the day. Yeah. He's already taken his spot in the bed. <laughs> My ready, spot in the bed. <laughs> ready to take his clothes off. Oh yeah, I'm gonna strip for you. You want that? Oh, I think we need to stop recording. See you guys tomorrow. All right.